this is unlike any car you've ever seen before. Because no one has ever thought this way about a car before. This is strength and lightness. This is an interior that exceeds the promise of the exterior. This is technological innovation in overdrive. This is the all-new Jaguar XJ. The stunning result of taking a very different road. Um, Thomas, just first of all, for reflect on the London Irish game at the weekend. Um, how good was it to come away with the, the bonus point win there? Yeah, I think, you know, we were lucky to get it, but we'll definitely take it in the end because, you know, it's, it's, a, it's an extra point that could uh, get us into second and have a home semi final. But uh, we didn't play our best footy, but we got there in the end, and uh, sort of that'll, that'll, that's a final result, so we can sort of not worry about that so much and worry about it this week. Yeah, um, as the clock was ticking down there and the ball fell loose, I think a lot of Tigers fans were shouting at Crofty to kick it into the into the stand. What, what were you thinking? Uh, I think I, I looked up and Crofty was already sort of a couple of feet away from the post and putting it down. So, uh, and then you sort of click, oh, that's a fourth, fourth try, bonus point, and yeah, well done, Crofty. So uh, now look ahead to Friday night at Welford Road under the lights, and you, you, you've gone on record many a time about saying how, how you like playing at Welford Road. Yeah, you know, it's always, it's, we haven't been there for a few weeks now, so it's always uh, great to go back there in front of the crowd and uh, everyone cheering us on. It's just it's a wonderful feeling, so uh, looking forward to it again on Friday night. Yeah, the sun's out, the pitches are going to be a bit firmer. Do you like them harder? Yeah, you know, it's going to be a lot of fast running rugby, I think, for Nick's uh, lead into the semi-finals now. So, uh, yeah, it's going to be a lot faster and maybe a little bit harder on the body, but uh, it's one of the things you look forward to, so there'll be a lot more running rugby and a few more tries for the crowd as well. It's like playing back at home, isn't it, with the hard grounds? Yeah, you know, it's uh, yeah, in the summertime there in uh, January, February, so, uh, so it's good that it's, uh, the weather's warming up and, uh, yeah, have a bit of, get a bit of tan now and uh, play a bit of footy. Yeah, <laughs> there's a few of you in the, in the squad that's just a bit pasty. Could do with a bit of sun, couldn't you? Uh, yeah, we probably haven't seen it as much as we wanted to, so now we're good to... I reckon by the time we go back to training, probably about 15 of the lads will be out sunbathing, so it'll be pretty fun. And um, family, the children, do they enjoy the sun? Yeah, I think uh, my youngest one, Troy, three, he'll be three in June, uh, just loves being outside, you know, just kicking kicking the balls and stuff. So uh, every time I come home from training, even a uh, hard day, double session, Troy grabs my hand and walks me outside and he have to kick balls and he gets a cricket bat out and hits the balls. So it's, nah, it's nice for him to be outside and just having a bit of fun. Is he a tiger in the making? Yeah, well, I think yeah, I think I think he takes after me, me more than uh, my wife Emma. So uh, if he, in that case, I'd say yeah, he could be. Yeah, and, and you've had your family over as well, haven't you recently? Yeah, I had mum and dad come over for my my wife went to her sister's wedding, so uh, mum and dad had to help me babysit. So uh, no, that was uh, they had a lot of fun. They came to uh, the Gloucester and they just been loving Irish. You know they. They love coming over here because the crowd's a lot different from back home. So uh, they just love sitting in there and just hearing the, the crowd chant and just love being at a live game. So uh, I think they, I think they've missed it a bit because my brother hasn't been playing so much back home. So I think they really enjoyed it. They're lucky Amens as well, aren't they? Yeah, they've uh, since I've since I've come over a few times now. We the Tigers haven't lost, so uh, that's been uh, that's been pretty good for myself and the Tigers.